Good morning. I have just now, within the last five minutes, decided I'm gonna film today. So, <laughs> I'm watching Le Lepsky, Le Lepsky's Life. I don't know if that's how you say it. Her last name is very confusing to say based on how it's spelled. Nick just got home. He was at work yesterday. Yesterday was um, an interesting day. I feel like I got hit with like 17 bills that I wasn't prepared for that are very high in number. So um, yeah, that was fun. Uh, today, what we have on the agenda is um, we've got, so I'm gonna be using this today. I have actually really been liking this. I think before the video that you are watching right now comes out, I'm gonna put this video out. It's kind of a funny story about how this ended up in the video because it's not supposed to be in the video. It's ridiculous how it ended up in the video actually, but I ended up really liking it. It's a viral drugstore um, product video. So check that out if you want, it's up. But um, I really like, I like this foundation a lot. I don't know if this is gonna be, that's a little pale red. I put some tanner on my skin last night, so I think I need a little bit darker, but I really like the packaging. Anyway, so on the agenda today is we are taking our motor home and dropping it off um, on our way down south. Our motor home, the slide is not working properly in it. So I don't know how much this is gonna cost. It's probably gonna be pretty pricey. Um, but yeah, the slide is not working. So we, you basically can't camp when your motor home is pretty much made all of slides. Like all the space in our motor home is like all slides. So we're gonna drop the motor home off and just pray that it's not super expensive. But I think it's like a motor. I think it's a motor issue because Nick did replace the inverter and that did not work. So, and we already just paid somebody to come. Oh my gosh, my face is peeling over here. We did just pay someone $150 to come out and kind of like troubleshoot at our house. I was just trying to get it taken off Nick's plate so he wouldn't have to drive it in. Um, Cause I don't really drive the motor home. And by don't really, I mean, I've never driven my motor home. Like I bought that motor home before Nick and I were even married and I've never driven it. Um, so that's what we're doing. And then after that, we are gonna try and squeeze in breakfast if we can, but I don't know if that's gonna happen. I feel like this is too pale for me still. Uh, I'll have to fix it with some bronzer. I don't have time to take it off and redo it. We have an appointment at the dentist. I have not been to the dentist in like, since I got my veneers on. So I have veneers on the top here. That's why they're a different color than my bottom teeth. Um, so if you get veneers, do the top and bottom at the same time. Um, my guy is all the way in Australia. So that trip, if you've been here that long, when Ryan and I were together and we were in Australia, that is when I got my veneers done and I have not been to the dentist since then. So um, I wanna say that's been almost 10 years which is not setting a good example for my daughter. The dentist is a good thing to be going to. So I'm gonna finish getting ready right here. And then we're also talking about, um, my skin is just peeling off. We're talking about trying to maybe go to Mission Beach and do a little bit of paddle boarding. It's funny, um, before Nick and I ever met, he invited me to go paddle boarding and um, I, it was at 1.30 in the afternoon, I will not forget it. And I was in the middle of working out and I looked down at my watch and read this text from this guy that I haven't even met yet. And I'm just like, this guy thinks that like my whole day's not planned out already? Like 1.30, like he's asking me to go paddle boarding? Like what the actual hell? So it's pretty funny. So we might actually have our first date happen um, the way that Nick had wanted it to. Oh, you got all my bathing suits on again. <laughs> Hi, mommy. Look at me. Look at this. What is this? What are all, you wearing? All my bathing suits? <laughs> <laughs> you don't have a toy to leave in here. Usually, she leaves a toy and then takes an item that she's not supposed to take. I'm gonna take that. Okay, she can take it. Mama's leaving. Oh, I love you, my sweet girl. You don't care. You gonna put this back on there? Oh, almost. Try again. 
Good job! Whoa! I love you, sweet girl. I'll see you when we get back. We just got to the dentist. This is like his old school dentist in PB, so we have to come all the way down here because he loves it. We've been here for like 15 years and been cleaning this pie hole. <laughs> um, so I forgot to bring foundation because usually they make a mess of your mouth, so I don't know how this is gonna look after. But let's go inside and see what they say. I haven't had my teeth cleaned in like 10 years, foundation. so. Foundation, like concrete? <laughs> my face foundation. You have foundation on your face? Oh yeah. I love your foundation, babe, it's great. Look at my foundation. skin peeling. Look at my forehead. My forehead is peeling off. Mm -hmm. um, I do have a bunch of makeup boxes back here though, so maybe if I need to bust into those, I can. We survived. We survived. I had <laughs> so much blood in my mouth cooling. I could just feel it. How did it go for you? Uh, basically no blood. They gave me a clean bill of health, said everything's great. I take great care of my teeth and uh, my pearly whites look amazing. Except for the hole in your mouth because you don't floss enough. Well, they, they, the way they said it, it's like everything else looks so good. This barely even matters, but we'll mention it to you. And <clears throat> that one lady was not very gentle. <laughs> so she told me I was such a good patient that I have a very high pain threshold and that I am so great I haven't moved or complained at all. And I was like, well, if I complain, it just makes your job harder and it makes me have to sit here longer. So it's funny because when she was get her doing done. mine, she was like, you're such a better patient than your wife and you have such a higher threshold. How would she pain. know she did me after you? So that's how I know you're full of shit. <laughs> and we're gonna go get some food because I haven't eaten a single thing today and it is two o'clock. So actually that's a lie, I had a, a cheese stick. Um, but other than that, I haven't had anything. Lowe's. It's really exciting. Decided to come here to get our countertop for the pantry. We're gonna do a butcher block on the other side because it's cheaper and it'll look cool. <laughs> Where are we going? Walk. Uh, he just bought the handles. Um, so I don't know if you guys have seen our pantry. I still haven't done a home tour. When the dining room is done, I'll do a tour of that area. But um, currently our dining room is where all of our clothing is until our closet's done. But um, the pantry has... I was kind of getting accustomed to it. No. I'm like always worried that Amazon's gonna be watching me change. Oh, um, it's my favorite part of the day. The pantry has... Uh, I got a little wink I do with the UPS guy now. You shut the fuck up. A little wink in the helicopter, you know? <laughs> Um, the pantry has uh, cabinets on one side and uppers on the other, so we're gonna do lowers on both sides so I can do like a little candle over there, but it turns out just isn't, hasn't been quite enough storage for all of our Costco trips of buying random shit we don't really need. Like, what is that thing that you got? The I was just gonna say, I've never been to Costco and bought anything that I don't absolutely need for sure. What was the ziploc -y sucker thing? Freezer storage? Um. I can't think of anything with this right here, like. I don't know, I'm having a pregnancy brain right now. <laughs> oh, you're something else. Would you, you wanna film my outfit for me? Oh my goodness, put that away. I'm gonna um, turn this towards you so you can see what. Good, I'm gonna get artsy. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. How is this artsy? This is the outfit today, the OOTD. I didn't think I was gonna be able to wear this. Okay, okay, you're gonna Check the link up in the corner over there. You're too far away. <laughs> this is my pregnancy outfit. Mm, this slit mm, is always on the wrong mm, side. You want some of this? There she is. It's like there's less uh, differentiation between the colors on that side as opposed to this side. <laughs> You gonna put it on your head? No. <laughs> I carry it like this. Huh? Is that fun? 
we got home and Harlow had like, <laughs> like a whole bathing suit just wrapped around all of her limbs walking around like it was a fashion statement. <laughs> oh, dad's bringing out the sprinkler. What's gonna happen, Harlow? What's gonna happen? Whoa, whoa, camera, hello. <laughs> did not expect it to do that. Okay, Very now good. we're nowhere near the child, so this is a problem. Also, by the way, they have the flavored ones at Walmart if you get chamoy and like put it in the, the kind of the front and like where the, the hole is to get the beer out or whatever. What, what am I blanking? I'm blanking on the word for that. Um, it's like so delicious. <laughs> Timer, drop it. Winnie, drop what it. you doing over there? Oh, it is a beautiful day. We just all ate some pizza. Dad is riling the baby up before, before bedtime. It is an hour past your bedtime, girl. We're wrestling. You're, yeah, I see that. She was I, her idea. <laughs> it's her idea? Harlow, do you want to open a present we bought for you? This box over here. I got some uh, vintage uh, toys for Harlow off Mercari. You want to go see? What are we going to see? What totally appropriate. I watched this with my dad all the time when I was a little cop. Whoa. Oh, this is not the vintage one. <laughs> what? I don't remember buying this. Oh, I think I bought this one at dinner with the Harris's. So this is not the vintage set that I bought, but it's a hit. Yay! Yeah! I went to Once Upon a Child recently and got her some stuff, and I was pretty disappointed at their toy selection, to be honest. So I turned to used toys on Mercari. Here's one of the little vintage toys that I got. And then I got a Fisher Price camera. You look through this, I don't think you're gonna be able to see it, but you look through there and you can see old pictures of like animals and stuff. And then I got her this little guy. You turn this. It's a little music box. I love old school toys, like they're so much better. Mercari is actually a really good place to buy them. I found so many. Ooh. And on that farm we had a chicken. And this and I need to wash all this actually, but um yeah. Well, I guess we're gonna keep watching Cops and I'm gonna get dressed because I just got out of the shower. I took just such a great shower. Oh, so good. Um, Nick's back at work tomorrow. So we're gonna enjoy watching something probably about murder <laughs> TV. <laughs> um, yeah, thanks for watching guys. A little, little day in life action. Um, supposedly our pantry is getting done uh, this weekend. So actually, let me show you guys what we're doing in there because it'll be part of the tour. Um, okay, so we have all on this side of our pantry, we have this and I never anticipated putting so much shit up here. Like I hate the way it looks. Like a little bit of that's okay with like, like a candle, but like I hate how this is on the counter. I hate how this is on the counter. I hate how this is on the counter. Like we just need a little bit more storage. These are actually packed completely full. So on this side, we're gonna end up putting these in the garage and putting this in the dining room. And then we're doing a 10 inch one. Same thing as over here, but not this countertop. We're gonna have the, um, whatchamacallit, the uh, butcher block that we bought today at Lowe's. So we're gonna put that on this side and then I'm gonna have this whole countertop and then I'm going to hang up here. I'm gonna hang my charcuterie boards like, up on this wall. And yeah, hopefully we don't need to add any uppers ever, but we have the option, I guess, if we need more space. But on this side will be like smaller things like some of our canned stuff, you know, that kind of like can get lost in here if it's too deep. So 
yeah i'm pretty stoked on that because i definitely could use a little bit more of the space like all of these things are much better off than like a shallower thing and now i can put like i'll be able to put you know bigger stuff over here so oh and somebody asked me recently what prenatal i'm on right now this is the one i have been on and i have it um i'll link it for you guys below this actually has a lot like more of all of the good stuff in it than some of the others do i don't like better than even was it the ritual one I, I don't know which one i compared it to but um yeah so you can get on a little subscription on amazon that makes it really easy because i kept forgetting with harlow to take them and or not to take them to buy more when i need more so this makes it real easy i got all these tinctures that i had from being pregnant with harlow <laughs> anyways um yeah getting some more storage over here so this will be really really nice to have another side and then i can put my candles put like a kit put like a cute little plant over here i don't know you know but just i would really love to clean this up so that's the dream anyways before my boobs fall out of this thank you guys so much for watching and i hope you're having a good day and we will see you in the next one bye